Hello there, child main Patrick here. I made this pretty neato Sai racetrack in my teapot, and I wanted to take you guys around for a tour of the place and uh, maybe get some people to race with me. So we've got our starting area here, a little boxed in. And of course, I put Sai there, so, because, you know, Sai is always ready to race. And uh, then over here, we just have the finish line. Just a, a little line, don't really have any rules on if it's when you touch it or when you pass it, but uh, you know, just that's 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 where you finish. Uh, and so this main course follows these little lantern guys here. Uh, I try to make it so you could see one from each of the next lantern places, so we'll take you around a tour that way first. You can go either way around here and then next place to go is up and we have one right here and see over there there's a different style of lantern I use that for secret passages so we'll come back for that on our second trip around the track here we've got some uh, some fun trees to dip around and to continue on we come across the next little guy yeah and continue following these tracks will lead you to this sort of open area. These are where two of the secret passages come from. But we will continue on the main track to our next little guy here. And now we're in the, the final home stretch. See, there's another little uh, sneaky shortcut you can take right there. And our final little lantern guy right in front of the finals, uh, the, the the finish line. Cool. Now, I didn't just want one wide open track, I wanted to have a few secrets that you could do to go faster, because you know, I'm all about secret speed running and, and fastness on my races, so create a few of these shortcuts you can take, most of them designated by this type of lamp. But however, I made them a little harder to get through, especially for not small, not as small uh, characters, because this is supposed to be, you know, Sayu's domain. So, let's see if we try and take the child through here. He, uh, he gets stuck. And, uh, I don't know if Kazuo can make it. Yeah, yeah, just the tall characters are excluded. But from here, there are two different paths. You can either come up here for a slightly shorter, but a very annoying little drop-down section. Or, okay, if I can get myself back. Can I? Oh, yeah, I can. So the other path you can take is straight through here. A little winding path, which is actually made to counter her because... Oh, no, never mind. I thought you could not ride through this little bump. That's what its purpose was, but uh, turns out I'm wrong. So, well, I don't know, maybe I'll change that in the future. But this is where the other secret passage is here. So I, don't know, I think if I count that, there's two branching paths, but they sort of meet up with each other down here. So depending on how adventurous you are, you get to go through this path, or you don't. And of course, the last little small time save is made in that, in that little corner there. But yeah, that is my Sayu racetrack, or at least the bottom track. I have made a second smaller track using the top here, which I guess I'll, I'll showcase now. So you start here, ride around on the right side of these fences, and you gotta hop up here into these little areas. Switch the child, he's a bit faster. Zoom. Zoom through here. That's another place gotten to. I want to say there's three of these. A nice right turn that you can get stuck on. You might need to jump out of. Jump the gap. Up here and almost finished. Yeah. 
So, the top track's definitely a lot simpler. Not as many shortcuts as the bottom one, but, you know, it was still fun. I felt like I, I had to try and make use of the space somehow, so. It kind of, it lined up perfectly when I was making the map, so. Yeah. That's my, my top section. But a few of the ways that... I guess I should go over the rules. So the rules I have set up are you can go over single high boulders or whatever these rocks are called, but you cannot go over two high things. So you can't can't cross here. Can't go like oh I'm just gonna call this a a path. No, not allowed. And so what that allows to do is for different characters to take different paths. And specifically Kazuha can, can jump these guys pretty fast. Which might even be faster than trying to take this shortcut if you were to get stuck. So I, don't know, I just wanted to make a lot of different options for, for people traversing the, the map. Because uh, I think options are fun. <laughs> But yeah, I think that, that sums up the whole course. Um, I have some footage of me building this in a time lapse, but it kind of seemed boring to watch, so I decided to exclude it from this video. And I also have some uh, some videos of my, my friends and I just, you know, having a few races together, so... I'm gonna show that, and then at the end, I'll have a little comparison of myself taking the three of the main different routes and seeing what the times are. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed uh, my little tour of my teapot, and if you want one, my initial creation is this little cave system thingamabob, and I had initially stopped working on it because of the load limit and uh this used to be completely filled up with load but now they changed it the change has finally come with this this island is completely filled up and yet this load is green and that to me is a miracle so uh yeah i'll probably be decorating this thing and then maybe i'll make a video showcasing it when it's fully decorated and fully kitted out right now it's just a mess of caves and a big dome. But yeah. Welcome to uh, stick around and watch that video if I ever get to making it. But yeah. That's uh, all I have for now. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the little, little tour. And if you would like to race with me, uh, just let me know in the comments. And uh, I would love to race. Shadows of fate! Ha 
があるのなら風を知れ風の赴く。Man, I felt super rambly. I think it is. But, uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you want me to make a video on my other things or other stuff, let me know. And, uh, perhaps I'll, I'll get along to them. Alright. Bye.